So anyway, this is Strider for the NES. I think they were gonna do, like, a port of the arcade version on the NES slash Famicom, and it didn't come out. So they have a version of Strider that's its own thing. This one's like a 2D platformer, but it's got a bit of exploration to it. Like, he just walks over to the computer with that, like, pose, too. Hear you. There's only one reason I asked you to come for. Kane was captured by the enemy. Since they once knew who he is, rescuing him is meaningless. Kill him. That's your mission. Kill Kane? I can't do it. The first thing is to find him. Well, let's look for him in Kazakh. This was also the uh, first level in Strider in Kazakh or Kazakhstan. Oh, that's right. This this level has flashing. So bear with me. Hey there, Tony. Good to see you. So you move with uh, the D-pad, you jump with A, you attack with B, you can even, like, do this... ...to, like, stab enemies that are above you. I think it's safe to fall down here, is it? Nope! Do you think people only know about Strider only through Marvel vs. Capcom? Depends on when they were playing. I've already got myself in a bad spot. Uh-oh. Oh god, I'm one hit from death already. The good news about this game, from what I heard, is that if you die, you just get kicked out of the level and you can just play through it again. There's like... There's no finite amount of continues or anything, and you keep whatever you picked up. Alright, we got file one. We'll have to analyze that disc when we go back to the Blue Dragon. That's the name of that ship, by the way. Oh, nice! There was, like, there's some invisible health items there. Hey there, Penne. I think that's for energy, which we don't even have any uh, special attacks yet. Okay, we need to climb up. The game will let me. Thank you. That was a bit of a rough start, but we somehow salvaged it. We don't need to go that way yet. We'll have to revisit some levels, too. Oh, they're dropping enemies from above. I don't like that. Oh, you have to hit the top part only. Hello. Level up! Please wait. A cane is up there, and the commander has the key. You'll find it if you analyze this. Please let me go. Okay. Captain Commando? Probably not for Marvel vs. Capcom, maybe from its own thing. Can't do anything about that wall, either. So, we have to walk all the way back. Or... You can actually just take a death and just go right to the Blue Dragon then.
But I first- okay, well, that's- that's you. That- that may not be the case for everybody. And I can't speak for her, but I can only speak for myself. Yeah, can I go under there? Yes, I can. Okay, that's a bit of a shortcut. So if you, like, need to look for healing items, it's always a good idea to just slash everywhere. Oh, there was there was probably something there. I don't think I'll need it though. The physics for this is not too great, especially when you're brushed up against a wall. Like you just fall instantly. I think the flashing is only in this stage though. So to exit a level, you have to go all the way to the beginning, and then you just jump. Alright, we gotta look at these discs first. All one analyzed. I'm Ryuzaki, a Strider. I left my attack boots in China. Please find them. Okay, I can just go to an entire country and just look for boots easily. Easy, no problem. It's not like China's a large place. All too analyzed. Vice Commander? It's me. I'll go to Egypt via Phantom Train. Don't lose the prisoner. Okay, so that's where we gotta go. We gotta go to Egypt. There's like a- there's speedruns where people usually just go to Australia and just do like some kind of pause glitch. And then you can just go to the final boss quickly. Obviously, we're not gonna do that here. Some of the enemies on the train, like not the cannons, they remind me of stuff from Shatterhand. Remember Shatterhand and a not Capcom game? There we go. That takes out the train. Now we're in the actual level. We gotta climb up a pyramid! Oh, nice, I actually jumped over it. You can get a nice boost if you just jump down a slope. It's crazy how much top speed you get. Okay, an S2 door that we can't go to either. you get for turning around, dumbass? You could have kept me, uh, stunned. Okay, there is something called a triangle jump. I don't know if you gotta do it here. I think we can go this way. Hi. Red Dragon with a subscription. Thank you so much, Red. I appreciate it. Uh, 33 months, too. Yeah, I think I have 
do have to go up again. Is the game even gonna let me do the triangle jump? Because it gets very wonky. Okay, there we go, I did it. But it has to be so precise. Like, you have to hold the... Hit the jump button and face away from the wall that you're jumping from. And obviously it's not very easy to pull off. Okay, but you can slide, so there's that. You have to go at a diagonal to do it. Hold on a second, can I go down this way? Nope, I, I think I messed up. I was supposed to get boots. And I didn't get them. Now I gotta do all this again. Oh, hey there, Dino. And now look where it puts you. Oh, why did my jump input drop? A long ride, I know, right? At least there are no enemies in that, uh, tube. So I had that going for me. Maybe I am supposed to go this way. I think this is also wrong. What the fuck? Also, I'm gonna drown. I'm dead. Okay, at least game start just puts you right back here. Do I have to beat the train again? I don't think I do. Oh yeah, you do. Oh, great. I don't know why you have to beat the train again. That doesn't make any sense. I've already beat it. Just take a few shots, it's no big deal. Seems you have little to no iframes when you take damage, too. So if an enemy is on top of you, they're just... You're just gonna take sustained damage the whole time. more of these shows someone's afraid of pickles? I believe I mentioned that on the stream. Are you kidding me? I jumped straight up. Why did it make me fall? Uh, 
Again, I don't know if I'm going the right way for these boots. No. Oh my fuck! This was the same place I went before. I've learned nothing. God, like, how do I keep always picking the wrong way? I just want a pair of boots. Try this way again. No, this can't be it. Yeah, I, I might rather you, you didn't until I ask. I think if I go down this way, this should be good. Ah, maybe this is it. No, oh, down here. The aqua boots. Oh wait, no, 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 can I go back? I have to go around the long legs. I need to get on the water. I got the boots that let me walk on it. I'm taking way longer in this area than I hoped. Like, you should be in and out of this place in maybe five minutes. And here I am taking an abnormal amount of time. Honestly, if you have like a turbo button, or a turbo controller, hey there, Hasty Steve, it makes the triangle jumping a lot easier. But how are you, uh, Steve? This is your first time here. I do a streamer variety of different games. Usually around five days a week, mostly bright show games, of course. And today we're playing Strider for the NES. And hey there, MB. Oh, I'm gonna need some health badly. Okay, so I can't go down the pipe. That's going to prevent me from getting to the water. Oh, hey there, Cole. Good to see you, too. I'm not hydrophobic, no. But, uh, Strider, or hear you will die if he stays in water for too long. That's why you have to get the aqua boots. OK, 
Get out! Alright, I remember where this is. Yep, this is the place. Now look what happens. You can just stand on water like it's nothing. There, I got the robot shark. Pops right in. Why do striders have to disturb us? Oh, okay. I'll give this to you. Please don't kill me. Key number two. There we go. Now we can open these doors. Is this the same guy from Marvel vs. Capcom? Pretty much, yeah. How's the game? Well, other than getting lost in Egypt, it's going fine. It's not too punishing if you take a death outside of, you know, losing progress. But you keep your items. Oh, I thought I had another disc. I did not. Alright, we're gonna go back to Kazakh. Usually if you get like a key or something or a new item that gives you progress or the ability to move better, go back to Kazakh. Because you usually get access to more areas. for the, uh, spikes again. So we gotta go back here again. And then we gotta go to the right. Do all that again. But this time we have to take a different path. I don't think I almost drowned, but what I hate about going in the water is that when it gets in my eyes... Especially when you're in a pool. Whoop! See, now you gotta go in here. Level ups only work if you actually grab an item or make story progress. So, Yar, hear you. Let me see Strider's power. You're gonna regret those words. See? I just beat, beat the boss. You can call it a boss. Kane, wake up! No response. Guess I have to bring him back to the base. Oh, get the disc. Good thing it didn't let me leave. Oh, I don't want to transfer. 
All right, I'm just gonna pick Australia. Actually, let's say no. Okay, that takes you back to that menu. All three analyzed. Something awful is happening. The Zane project should be interrupted. The chief in Japan might know something helpful. All right, so we go to Japan. Under orders of the Vice Director, we can't let you pass here. We shall kill anyone who comes close. Oh, that was a good try. Not. I think you go this way. I'll fix your cipher so that you can shoot plasma. Hey there, care. Oh, and he just doesn't do anything anymore. So now if you do this, you now have like a, a projectile. Problem with that is like, it takes a while to charge. And you can't hold on to that charge while you move. Hello. You've gotten stronger here, you. Take this with you. Another floppy disk. Hey, it was like, in the late 80s, floppy disks were actually floppy. Imagine that. Oh, as you level up, you learn new tricks. And this is what your energy is for. Medical is for recovering health. You got fire and you got spark, those are your projectile attacks. Jump lets you jump higher, but only for a few seconds. If you only select Trick, then you can just attack normally. Alright, we got disc number four. What does it say? Here to you. Zane is a dreadful weapon created by the Syndicate. It penetrates into your mind, and makes you crazy. Hurry! There is one in China. Haha! <laughs> Here you! You'll be sent to your grave by me, Mr. Kane! Die! Same. My sister was the same way when she lost her mind. Zane, I'll destroy you to the last circuit! Sheena, please take care of Kane. So we gotta go to China. So I also gotta keep in mind there's those battle boots too. Let's see if we can find them. Maybe in here? Nope. That leads to a, an S4 door. Oh, I thought you hit the core. How do you deal with this? Oh, I had to hit it in the back? That doesn't seem like a reliable way to do it. Hey there, Karilu. Oh, I thought I selected it. Oh, here we go. Now it's selected. 
Okay, that should get me back to full health. Or close to full health. Not necessarily full. Took me a long way to get down, and now I gotta get up again, but in a different building. I wonder how things would have been if they actually did the Genesis port was also this. So, I mean, this is not too bad on its own. Oh, I picked up a skull pill. Yeah, there are actually items that hurt you. These are the boots. The magnet boots. We got them. So I think we can use these back in Kazakh. What the hell? Why did the scientists spawn here? <laughs> Did you go to my room? The key number four should be at Kazakh. Uh, okay. So I got like two different kinds of boots on at once. That, that's just how it works. I gotta look for the scientist room to get it to the key four. Funny enough, you would get key four before you get key three. Alright, we gotta go back to the flashing level again. I wanna shield your eyes for like 20 to 30 seconds. Bear with me for a moment. There! I actually remember to hold right this time. So I didn't have to deal with Spike Hell. I think I'm disappointed he does not have is the ability to, uh... Attack downward. Oh wait! I got an idea. Let me use the jump power. Oh, I thought it would just get me up there and I could just take a shortcut. Doesn't work that way. And then it just expires after a few seconds. Is your imagining too hard? I wouldn't worry about it. Games back then were all about using your imagination. Okay, so I gotta go back to this glowing wall that I saw before. Remember, we got the magnet boots. So how does this work? Like that. Oh, I have to hold left to go up this way? 
Hey, we're doing the classic Batman show walk. Oh, hey there, Anubis. Good to see you. Heard that black cats and last cats get adopted? Uh, so are, uh, humans and Stuart Little. Oh, sweet. We got key number four. So now we can go back to that door in China. That's right, there's a certain trick called warp that allows you to just head back to the entrance, but we don't have it yet. We have not done enough stuff in the game to deserve the right to just fast travel back to the beginning. Like, for something that's very different from, like, the arcade original, this is still a really good game. But, I mean, it's no surprise. Usually, if a Capcom game is different from the arcade original, if it, and it's released on the NES, chances are it's just as good, if not better. Like, Gun Dot Smoke. Oh, a Capcom is in a pickle to pick Quither a mascot. They wanted to go with Captain Commando, and they were really trying that, and it just didn't pan out. Wait, I think I already analyzed Disc 4, didn't I? Yeah, yeah, I already, I already read this. Okay, so I have to go back to China. Yeah, it's more Street Fighter. Who knows, there could be like a remix of uh, Mega Man's 1 through 3. I mean, I'd play them, but if I were to choose, I'd probably want something else. Like, an actual Breath of Fire that's not a mobile game. At least now we can go this way. Oh, shit! Something to do with the shield. Ah, I think I got an idea. Oh, but it may not always work. Okay, I'm gonna have to heal. Okay, I think sliding and attacking works. There we go. I did it. Oh, this again? Imagine the budget they have for, like, infinite amounts of spike traps like this. 
Those cannot be cheap. I should not fall down. Hmm. I hope this was the right way to go. Oh, that's okay. These turrets don't have enough time to aim and hit me. Also, hey there, Arnie. Good to see you. You didn't miss too much. Ah. What was missed was my jump. I hope I'm going the correct way. Oh shit. Jumps I cannot see very well. I think I was supposed to take that out? Oh no, I think I'm supposed to take out the head now. Oh, shield your eyes. Key number three. I did it. So I guess I can go back to Kazakh again. Hear you! Can't escape when I took my eyes off of him! He seemed to be in his right mind, but his wound is not healed. Oh, you got things to take care of? Don't worry about it. Alright, so we gotta go back to Kazakh again. Oh, but we do have warp now. Which means we don't have to walk all the way back to the beginning every time. I wonder if there's like a ROM hack for a Strider on NES that removes the flashing. Because I know they usually have hacks that remove this kind of issue. Speaking of patches, uh, there was a Super Famicom game that I wanted to check out. Uh, Melfan Stories? Uh, it finally got a patch now. Now we can go through this door. We waited so long. Oh, no! I need you to check around the corners in case there's any secret items. Who knows, this could be the last time we ever need to go back to Kazakh. Lord knows we've been there so many times. Shit, I don't know which way do you go. Wait a minute, I think I know where this is. 
Oh, I'm back at the beginning! Ah, oh, shit. How the hell was I supposed to know that? I thought I was making progress as normal! So now I gotta redo all this crap again. Oh, no flashing patch? Ah, oh, that's too bad. Oh, let's heal up. Let's try a different way. Uh, maybe it's to the right we gotta go. Yeah, this looks about right. We meet again. File number five. Well, it depends on the game. File five analyzed. Commander in Chief, Mr. Fastius Clay, we, the Strider Matic Unit, will protect the Zane in Africa. Oh, that's where we're going next, Africa? Just, just this part of Africa. Oh, that's right, we have the Aqua Boots. So we just gotta dodge the crocodiles. Oh god, there's even birds in this. It had to be birds. Basically, for any protagonist that's even remotely a bit ninja, birds are just, like, the bane of one's existence. Ah! You have to wait for it to sink down so you can actually make that jump. What? I assume I'm going the right way. Like, I'm as high up as I can go. I'm gonna try my best not to fall off if I can help it. Ha! I'm one of the Zanes in here. Ah, 
inconclusive so far. Ah, oh, I should have healed and then grabbed the energy. Are so good. Oh! Okay, I think I gotta make that jump. And I did. I hate that enemy so much. Okay, it's always like three shots. Yeah, best of luck with the test testing. Hope it works out. Oh wait, I think those stalactites are hitting me. Uh, I wonder what happens if I fall down. Well, there's an easy way back up. And there probably was. Alright, round three! Oh, this one moves faster! It always seems to fire those, like, four bullets down the middle. Level up! File number six. I think that's the last one. Do the analysis. What do we got? I'm fastest clay. Oh my god, look at that stash! Man, you could stab people with a mustache like that. Holy crap. I have an appointment with Maddox in Los Angeles. Take care of things when I'm gone. Sheena! Sheena! Where did she go? I assume to Los Angeles. Look at our max stats now. 70 HP and 60 energy. How can you go wrong with that? Oh, this looks like a trap. I should not take the first one. Let's take the one on the far right. I chose correctly. What was the name of the Shaft Mr. T character in Dexter's Lab? Honestly, I don't know. Oh, it's another biker. Only this terrain was less- <laughs> Look at that pill! It was bouncing! Is this still LA? Oh, sorry, Sheena. Here are you! Please defeat Matic. Get revenge for- me. Alright, it's up to me now. Uh, get up there! Watch this. 
It goes through the glass. Then we gotta be closer. Ha, you fools! This tempered glass can't be broken by human power. You should have sided with me as Matic did. Oh, maybe you gotta talk and then you gotta use the blast. He just sits there. That can't be true! You... Monster! Hey, I leveled up! And I got key number five. Just hit him again. Okay, so since we got like a level five key, I don't think there's anything like keeping us from going to Australia. So let's go to Australia. I got SP ball. Maybe this will let me get out. Nope! This does not help me at all. Just use warp to get out of here. Alright, I got a new plan. We use jump before we make that leap. I mean, we should have enough energy to continue on regardless. That's better. And even then, we barely made it. Oh, don't get that. What? That shot sent me back up. <laughs> what a cruel joke. This game has jokes. Oh, look at this, another cave. Hello. Go after Matic. It's all his scheme. Uh, sure, I'll do that. It better not be a trap. Okay. Maybe I gotta go up to find the boss. Again, a turbo controller is a must if you're gonna do triangle jumps reliably. Wait a second. Um... This looks familiar. I think I'm back in Africa! No, I hear this actually... In a, there's a game that you could take a pipe that'll send you all the way back to Africa. All right, go back to Australia. So let's just do this again. I don't think that was a level that looks like Africa. No, that was Africa. 
You know, the, like the famous landmass that's right close to Australia, Africa. Totally not a made up thing at all. There's that guy again. Maybe I just ignore that. Maybe maybe I spare off going the other way. Yeah, what if I just go here? Oh, it's just a samurai again. You know that one dinky pill. Yeah, I'll just get a big one right there. In the corner. Usually that's where all the good pills are. In the corner. Okay, this is the place. Oh, that one is actually a little bit smarter. Now it's always on the left. I did it! Hear you! I tricked to catch Matic, but I failed. Hurry, hear you. He, he is at the Red Dragon. Wait, what are you talking about? She's in chat. Why is she in the game? Red, is there something you're not telling us? Like, why are you in this game? <laughs> Yo, look at my energy now! Holy crap! It went from 100 to 150! Well, I think I can make this without using up jump. I gotta do this just right. I don't want to use up energy if I can avoid it. the max is still pretty high. But I'm guessing this is the final area since it doesn't let you go anywhere else at all. That uh, empty spot for boots is mandatory. I'm pretty sure you can get by without it. I hope. Up. Oh, why did it do the slope jump? Oh man. Up. Oh, ah. Uh. I don't know how long this level is, either. Oh. Uh. Game! Game! So they fire infinitely. They don't even stop. 
Guess I'll, let me try if I didn't stop either. There we go! I made it. Okay, it looks like I have a choice. Let's try this one. Here you! You've done well so far! But you can't defeat me, Matic, the Vice Director of the Striders. Ha ha ha! I'm willing to try. Oh yeah, to get him when he's jumping. Uh, let's just use... ...the better one. Oh, he does so much damage on contact. Oh hey there, Neil, good to see you. We're at the uh, last area of the game, pretty much. I wonder how many hits this Jaboni takes. That many. Oh, a scientist. Matic is in the room over there. However, we can't open this unless we destroy two systems somewhere. Okay, that's the door we need to get into. But something about two systems? I'm gonna try over here first. Maybe that's it up there. Hello. You traitor! You shall die here! You were saying? As I checked, I'm the one that's still alive. Oh! Pfft. Okay! <laughs> cool! I think that was the first system. Oh, come on, that's bullshit. You put it, like, right in front of me so I can't move. <sighs> Might have to farm these enemies to even get some health or, uh, weapon energy. In case I have to fight another mid-boss. Just that health pickups are very rare. Weapon energy even more rare. So I'm gonna stick around for a little bit. Make sure I have more than enough. I don't know if there's a better room. I can just keep giving me hordes of enemies? But I think if I can get above 100 HP, that's a, a safe zone. So I'm just gonna take a couple minutes at this, at the most. I think it'll be for the best. The last thing I want to do is like do all this again. So I bet if I die and come back here, I have to de destroy the other system, the first one again. 
wouldn't put it past the uh, game to be like that. Actually, I think the, the third boots, the ones that I did not get, they would actually let me attack while I'm sliding. I just didn't find them. Unless they're somehow in this level. That would be all kinds of unhinged. Especially if there was like an encounter right there. Where the slide attack would have been good. And they were like, uh no, you get that afterwards. Like, oh thanks. Not like I needed it earlier. Yes I did. Let me see if I can get to 131 and then we'll move on. Yeah, weapon energy is just not dropping at all. But it goes to show you don't have to pick up everything in the game. Like, you can beat the game. Oh, there we go. Like, missing one or two things, then that'd be fine. Oh, this is the correct way to go. Oh, fuck. Oh, I don't like where this is. Where does it put ya? Like in Mega Man 3 for the Game Boy, if you get Rush Gen, the level you could use it the most. That sounds about right. Hang on, can I despawn you? Yes. Oh, sweet, that was actual weapon energy. I was wondering when you'd pick some up ever again. Oh, this looks so awkward. Also, I'm noticing, like, if you do this, you cannot even walk. Like, if you jump, you can't walk back on. Oh, you have to, like, hit the top of it. Okay, there's the hitbox. I was like, does this thing even have a hitbox at all? Thankfully it does. But you can only get it when it extends. Which is weird. This looks like where the second system is. The main tree, you Dizero, is a demon's weapon. Watch out here, you. I think that's supposed to say Yggdrasil. Good thing I walked back. But there, that's the second system. Yeah, I'm gonna repeat the same thing again because I'm an NPC. Yeah, it is the way back to the door. 
Maddox is in the room over there. However, we can't open this unless we destroy two si Yeah, we- I got him! You have not been paying attention! You didn't even try to open the door! Hear you! Welcome to our Red Dragon. We'll dance on your grave. What? This is it. I think this is the final boss. I wonder if the plasma shot would have been good against that enemy. But I've never needed it, so... Okay, now this fight's even worse because there's less space. Took some damage, but I'll be okay. Uh oh. Okay. Got him. So I guess it's just a mid boss gauntlet. Oh, this prick again. Why does he only drop one pill each time? You made it, hear you. I'll turn you into the rust of my cipher. Okay, I see what you gotta do. You gotta get him with your plasma shot. And there I won. I beat him. But I'm really low on health. Be careful! He dead rolls behind it. Get the extra energy. So we got one more boss. It's just another one of these. Oh, I just tanked it out, but I won. Thanks to hear you, Zane the Devil's weapon has been destroyed. Although the chief asked hear you to return to the group, he quietly turned it down and started to walk. Ellipsis. Dramatic walk. Gotta play it up for the end credits. I mean, he's lost a lot of people that he cared about throughout this mission. Who can really blame him?
fades away into the ether. Or it could be a sprite glitch, I don't know. <laughs> and then the music gets happy again! So anyway, that's it! That's Strider for the NES. That's another game, uh, beaten. How about that? I feel pleased by that, I'll say that much. Only had, a uh, one death. And that was in that stupid Egypt level. And then after that, it just got a lot better. Hold on, while that's going, let me look up where the other booths were. Okay, slide attack boots I'm looking for. Magnet boots. Slide attack. Oh! It turns out the slide attack boots are in China. So China actually has two sets of boots you can get. 